It may be the most sought after ticket in town, but you can't be a Detroiter to attend. Detroit Homecoming has one singular mission. Bringing homegrown talent back to the Motor City. And organizers are definitely rolling out the red carpet to do that. Coco McAvoy is live at the Lexus Velodrome in Midtown tonight. And Coco, as we've seen in years past, this is such a cool event. Yes, good evening. This is a very cool event. It's now in its fifth year and it started off with just about 100 people meeting, trying to revitalize the city after the bankruptcy. But now it's turned into something much bigger. How we continue to bring the world to Detroit. The Lexus Velodrome transformed into a reunion venue of sorts. It's called Detroit Homecoming. Detroit has a unique and wonderful emotional hold on its people, both here and elsewhere. Jim Hayes is the founder of the three day event. It brings back people who grew up in the Detroit area to reintroduce them to their city and hopefully inspire them to uh, invest in their community, their old hometown. It's working. Over $300 million in investments has been brought in. It's also a way to meet people and we're spread all throughout the country. We have one thing in common is that we all love our city. Tudo fam has an extra special connection to homecoming. Met my husband here, so I think uh, I'll say that that is the best outcome from Detroit homecoming. Tudo and David met at homecoming two years ago and got married at Eastern Market in August. It's not only our hometown, but it's the city we met and it's the city we love. And now, that we'll be moving back to Detroit, so we're we're very excited about that as well. Detroit homecoming is about more than bringing money into the city. It's an opportunity to develop relationships to last a lifetime. And the last day for this event takes place tomorrow. Back to you. Coco, uh, attendees, I understand, have uh, some pretty interesting plans for dinner tonight. Explain that. Yes, it's really cool. So the attendees will actually be going into Detroit neighborhoods, into private homes to have dinner with people, and that really gives them a chance to connect with others. And we're told that the people who are hosting these dinners are people who are making a difference in the communities. Yeah, and neighborhoods has been a theme in the past with that. Good to see that. Coco, thanks.